Hello, hello. I've been asked how I made these collage snippet rolls and today I want to show you a quick tips how I make these. You can use any method you like but, but uh, I like to do these on the uh, like a canvas fabric uh, so first that you need is the fabric I just ripped it and that's it's a little bit wonky but it's okay it's it really doesn't matter it's a quite a straight still and what you need is what you like to what you like to put your snippet roll i like very much uh, tim holtz tissue papers and there is very much options vintage black and white i have many uh, different kind of collage papers but I like to make some of papers myself you know when you are crafting and you have um, leftover paints like acrylic acrylic paints I like to use a tissue paper what you pattern paper use are sewing clothes and uh, you need to trace the pattern you need this kind of it's like a daily paper but it is tracing or pattern paper I used to put the excess paint leftover paint to this kind of small pieces there is splashes and and uh, different different uh, kind of this is very big big one where i can rip the pieces i want to use i i use very much this kind of uh, papers so when you start you have to pick what you need to use and that i like to use and in that point I I use these and I think the best glue is uh, some glue it what is quite liquid and this is art medium this is not a properly this is uh, in fact, to um, what is this English? Photo transferring, not not gluing, but this is very liquid glue. I have collage medium, but it was too thick to this. But you can use anything you like and uh, I also have a bunch of different scraps <laughs> I like scraps and there I pick some pieces I want to use and I pick here something be nice okay
so now we have to let this dry and then I saw the edges with the sewing machine and I'll be right back. Okay, now I have sewn the edges and make here a few to its, uh, its feather now. And if you have a here anything you can rip it off it's it's easy to rip and now we have to add text texts if you want and i have you used tea bags dried tea bags and stamp it on tea bags and now now I just sew these to the snippet roll and now I have to show you that the leftover paints what I glued first here they are quite nice it's kind of um, it looks like I have splattered the, the paint there yeah uh, so next step is the texts Now we are done. I can show you. 